Welcome back, guys. This is it. This is the big one. This is the big test of this system. Can it survive an almost full 29-day drought? So, what are we going to do in this episode? Well, my primary focus is going to be finishing the, the upper aqueduct. We've, we've got all along here. We've got round the corner. But this here is a big chunk to do. I mean, this is only like a couple of tiles deep. Here, oh God, that is a big build across there. So, yeah, that's, that's going to take some doing. But before I start any of that, I want to go around here. I'm going, to, I'm going to pause the game, actually, before it goes completely dark. And over here, in our, in our flood defense trench, we've got about like half a tile of water sitting here, not doing anything, that's going to completely go to waste. Um, I want that. That's mine. What do we say? What do we say, picture? Mine. Mine. <laughs> mine. So what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to demolish this windmill and this log pile. Goodbye. Throw your filthy stuff out in the street. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put two pumps in here. And I'm going to pump this water into the reservoir. That way, because I was going to build across here and widen this. Um, but I feel like doing something stupid. And it's my game. It's my, <laughs> it's my bat and my ball. And I'm going to do it. Okay? If anybody's got a problem with that, well, keep it to yourself, frankly. <laughs> first pump is going to be there then one two three four the second pump will be there so i'm going to have to dynamite um well just a one there would be fine that's going to be at that height then we want a channel three long one wide coming down here the next pump will be there and then we want power going down oh now haha <laughs> I want the power coming to. I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to do it the other way around. And oh, good lord! Yeah, I can do it the other way around. It's still gonna work. <laughs> I'm gonna make the damn thing work. It's my stupid project. I'm gonna make it work. What am I looking for? So we'll do. We'll put the pumps on this side. We'll put, have the power going down on this side. Oh yeah. Well, I can get rid of that. That's fine. So I can route it up there and into that pump, and then it'll step down here into this one yeah that'll work will it go yeah <laughs> yeah i think so so that's going to have to be dynamited down that'll go down one level that'll go down two and then this will these will be down three okay yeah i can do that you'll see like when when i've actually finished it you'll understand okay first layer is complete let's blow this up god i hope i've mapped this out right i'm looking at it now i'm thinking is that right I think it's right. Oh, now, you know what? This is something worth mentioning. It's worth having at least a few builder bots. Most of my most of my bots are regular beavers. But if you have some bots, when the beavers go to bed, so the, the beavers will come up and they'll put down the, the dynamite. But if you've got some, some, some builder bots, they'll actually stick around all night and finish off what the beavers have left undone. It's very cool, actually. Okay, that's done. Let's detonate that. And I'll get the next layer in. Okay, dynamite's laid. They've done the power on this side. They're doing the power on that side. Good job, beavers. Now, whilst I've been doing this, I've also been doing a little sneaky thing around the back. <laughs> you enjoyed that one, did you? I'm sorry, yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, here's my little sneaky thing around the back. So we can dynamite that boom they've got the stairs in good job and what do i want i want some more stairs in there and prioritize that good job right why have you built sca stairs down scares it's, it's all the halloween talk uh wh why have i built scares down here i've built scares down here because um i actually want to do a little bit of dynamiting down here because if you look at this um i mean this works perfectly because water can cascade literally over this whole thing so any water here will run down into this area because this is one tile lower than this you can see was i lying no i wasn't and then if we go around further it steps down again here into this level well in in an attempt to save as much of the water as possible i'm going to do a bit of dynamiting down here okay 
And so we can dynamite this, can't we? Yes. Right, now I find out if I've screwed this up, <laughs> which is usually the way. I do know that I've got a dynamite a tile there, but let's see if I've got the rest of it right. So I need another step down, don't I? Yeah, power. Power um, steps down there. We go round the corner like that. Then we want a pump, which I'm not going to put in now, but I just want to see if I've got it right. Yep. So the pump goes there. That works. And then we have a pump up there. Awesome. So to complete the power, all I've got to do is have the corner there. Oh, my God. Sky, you may have actually built something without, like, a single screw up. I haven't finished yet. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Trust me on this. As soon as they finish this, in fact, that's good enough. Blow that. Slide down again. Uh, now I can get the pumps in, so or I can get one pump in, so they can get building it. Uh, oh, no, this has got to go down another level. I forgot. Oh. Uh, what do I want? Landscaping. Dynamite. Um, I could actually take that down, like, one more, couldn't I? I could have a little little extra pit to save even more. Um, i got, I got to say, it's, it's kind of sort of tempting. I could even take this down another level, couldn't I? I could. We're almost done. I'm just waiting on this one dynamite to get done. Is somebody going to come and do this? Like, sometime this century would be kind of... Oh, was he going round? Yes. We're going to get it done. Hooray. Right. Detonate that one. Detonate those three. Pause it. Pumps. One pump goes in there. Perfect. Perfect. And that pump's going to go there. So, all I need now is to get that dynamited down one throw that dynamite in that's it um detonate that we can put the top pump in what do i want that pump goes there okay so that's going to be connected to the power yeah but, but but we just that that's got all the stuff wow and there it is done and it starts pumping woohoo and we're going to recover all of this water and i mean there's a fair amount of it it's certainly worth getting right we've got a bunch of dynamite in down here um let's see yeah now do i do i blow that or do i extend it a little bit I'm, i must admit i'm thinking of extending it a bit okay they've done it all good job well done beavers detonate that Awesome. Do, do I go down one more level? I think I probably do. You know, I'll do that offline because I've got to backfill that and put some stairs in it and do that. Right. What else? Well, while our beavers have been busy doing that, obviously that only took a few beavers. What were all the other beavers doing? Well, the terraformers were working on this. We've just done the next step up. So we're, we're going to have one, two three lots of, of uh, water wheels that's going to be a fourth i think i think there's i mean we could probably squeeze in two lots but i think there's just going to be one because i think i'm going to have to do a bit of work on the tower to make it work anyway i'm going to leave myself some leeway so i think we'll just have one more of water wheels and then we'll have a bit of a bit of a, a bit of spare space i could fill it up with water wheels afterwards if things work out particularly well okay so what have all the other builders been doing well they've been over here they've been dynamiting um i've already dynamited some of it and i did that to try and save as much water as possible to get it into because it was it was on here i think yes was it on there i don't know but i was trying to get it down into the into this layer uh, so that we save some evaporation. They're still working on it. Have you not finished yet? Oh, there's a there's a little bit hot. Isn't that just like beavers? They've sneakily hidden the work that they haven't done. <laughs> Look at this. It's like it's like he always looks at it from this perspective. Look, so we'll we'll hide it behind. Just hide it behind these pillars. You will never notice. Ah, caught you. They're like, oh, quick, lay it in quick. <laughs> Right, uh, I'll wait for them to finish and then uh, and then blow that up. Okay, what else have you been doing then, Sky? 
Uh, okay, over here, I threw in an extra smelter manned by a by a manly timber bot. Well, a beaverly, beaverly timber bot. <laughs> uh, big burly chap he is. Um, let me slow this down a little bit. There we go. So I, I've thrown in two of the underground storages because the the regular the regular piles only hold like 180. These things hold 10 times more, 1,800. And I want a load of uh, metal blocks for a little vanity. Well, it's not little, that's the thing. For a big vanity project that I'm going to be doing over here at the Mega Gigatera Dam. Oh, yeah. Right, so how are we getting on? Um... Yeah, I mean, I've got to lay this in now. That's that's a just laying it in is a job. So, yeah, I suppose I better just get on with that. We've pumped all the um, pumped all the water out of there, so there's no panic to do anything more there. Uh, I'll get that. I'll get that done. But right now, yeah, I need to focus on getting as much of this done in this wet se wet season in this dry season as possible. We got uh, we're on cycle 91, day 20. We've got 17 and a half days. I wonder how much of this I'll get done. Well, it's in, and my God, that's a big chunk of dirt. It really, that took me quite a while just to lay it all. My God, I need to extend that path. Okay, well, we'll let them get on with that. Uh, I'm going to need to put another, another pile in fairly soon. But we'll let them get on with that. Uh, we'll go over here where we have emptied the eyeball reservoir. And now we're dependent on the water in the lower reservoir. Which uh, we've got, what? Uh, two and a half tiles or so. And we've got, where are we up to? We're at Cycle 91, day 25. We've got 12.3 days left. Will that last 12.3 days? They've done the dynamite all round here. But then I took the path out and they haven't had a chance to finish doing that yet. So I'll let them get on with that and then we'll, we'll dynamite that down and then that's done. I'm starting to think this looks more like an ear than an eye. Picture, does that look more like an ear? Now, yeah. so now I've said it. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Yeah. Well, it's not. It's an eyeball. <laughs> it's an eyeball. Get over it. Loads of people suggested different names for this. It's, it's an eyeball. It's not an eye bowl. It's not a toilet bowl. <laughs> it's not. Oh, you should have seen some of the suggestions that we've had, Picture been crazy the comments are uh, an interesting place they really are they keep me entertained leave more comments guys seriously like leave a comment at the end of the video even if it's see whatever i say now <laughs> that's it's what they'll type yep even if it's just tickety boo <laughs> there you go that's confused anybody who's not british yes. like what what did you say? What did you say? Is that a word? Is that really a word? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was talking about um, what I did over here with putting the uh, the smelter. Let me slow it down because it's a little bit, a little bit slow. Um, yeah, I put the smelter in here. I'm seriously thinking that I should relocate more of my industry over here. Uh, I'm going to go and have a little look around and see if there's anything sensible like i mean do i do i move the other smelter i mean i'm thinking that makes a lot of sense because the metal is coming from here and we're producing enough of it we could certainly support the other smelter over here so that, that makes sense i'm gonna have a look around and see if there's anything else that makes sense that we could uh, that we could move out of here it's cycle 91 day 33 and we've got five days left of this drought and if i sound happy it's because I am. Because if we go down here, over a tile left, and we've only got 4.9 days. So we're going to be fine. We're not going to run out of water. In a 30-day drought, we're not going to run out of water. That's awesome. Let's celebrate by having a big explosion. Let's speed that up a little bit. Now, if I'm right, that's, that's filled in around the back. So this is going to go all the way around. Yeah, that, that's pretty big. That's a lot of dynamite. And that is creating like a fair amount more space in this reservoir. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, they had not finished. 
Oh, because I oh, I messed that up. I messed that up. I want a bonehead. <laughs> well, you know what? I'll put um, I'll just put a path down to it. We'll get that filled in. Anyway, the main thing is we're ready. This is ready for the next season. I must admit, I, I mean, I would obviously love it if we were if we were going deeper in a bigger area. But you know, it's fine. It's fine. Sometimes you've got to sacrifice for the aesthetics. It's all good. How are we getting on over here? And the answer is good. I've done some work on getting the stuff up there quicker because th I was finding that they were this was running dry all the time. And it was because the haulers were having to go, like, from picking the picking the dirt up, they were going to have, they were having to go round here and round here and up here, like a really long way to get there. Whereas now they pick it up and it's like, ship, 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 done, delivered. And now these are full all the time, which is awesome. It's also quicker for the, like, the, the catalyst and the biofuel. Much shorter route for the haulers. So this is, um, I won't say sprinting along. I mean, it is, but it, it's, it's slow movement forward. There's, there's lots of bloop bloops going on from time to time. It's a bit slow at the moment. Uh, I don't know where all the, I don't know, where are all the bots? I don't know where all my bots are. They, I think it must be a bot holiday or something. But yeah, it is uh, it is progressing and it's progressing very nicely. It's cycle 91, day 37. The drought is ending in point one of a day. How have we done? Let's have a look. Our batteries are still going. In fact, we're still above the water on the on the central the central platform. And all the other batteries are still going. Even the even the ones on the side, even the smallest ones, have still got a little bit of power left. So we survived on power. Uh, while I'm here, by the way, I'll just point out these uh, this little vanity project of mine. Uh, these these only run when there's water to be pumped. They don't consume any power the rest of the time. So they're not um, they're not a, an extra drain on the on the batteries. So that's really good. Uh, let's go over and look at the reservoir. How did the reservoir do? Look at this. We've still got more than a full tile of water left in the lower reservoir. So, we did it. Yes! We survived a 29-day drought. Like, easily. I'm very, very pleased right now. All right. Well, just imagine when we get this completed. Can we just imagine it? No, I've actually got to do it. Oh, all right, then fine. I'll get on with it. Well, it's day four of the wet season. We haven't had the warning yet. So we're getting at least seven, at least seven days of water. Can we get a full eight? That's, that's a bit much to ask, but we'll see. The, the batteries have not... Oh, yes. The centre batteries are just emerging from the water. <laughs> Oh, no, we're not going to get the full eight, but we are going to get seven days, which is going to be a decent amount of water. How are we doing for power? Let's have a look. Uh, well, with the with the windmills doing a pathetic 92 out of a possible 400, we're doing 67,000 power. Good grief. No, one, no wonder our, uh, our batteries are charging up there. I did it again. I said charging. <laughs> char charging. No, never mind. Okay. Okay, well, I guess we'll wait. Uh, we'll wait till the end of the wet season and see how much water do we get because we've got a lot of recovery to do, and we'll see. We'll see if we get any flooding and, and see if my vanity pumps actually get to do any work. Oh, this is fun. Okay, well, we've got a seventeen-day drought, and the water, the water's just stopped. Oh, we've got another little, another little bit coming through. The last, the last dregs are draining out, and uh, yeah, we got, we got a reasonable amount. Where I mean, we flooded into the, into the eyeball, and our batteries are, are pretty much full. They're not quite full, but pretty much full. But with a 17-day drought, they'll be full again next season. Oh, <laughs> awesome! Right, we've got uh, we've got 15 days left. I wonder how much I can get done. 
It's cycle 92 down 19. We've got 5.8 days left on this drought. And we're now coming at the aqueduct from both sides. And progress on this side, I mean, we're making solid progress, but it's slow. The problem with this is they can only work on, on a few tiles at a time. So I, I found I got bots sitting around doing nothing. So I decided to put them to work and we're building from both sides and we're closing the gap. We are closing the gap. It's happening. Uh, water. Water, the water's held up well. Let's have a look. How much how much water have we got? Good lord. It's about two and a half tiles left. That's great. And the batteries. Batteries are still doing great. There's, all except the end row are above the water. So the terraformers have got lots of work to do, but the builders are sitting around doing virtually nothing at the moment. So I want to get them to work. I did get them to put the platforms in um along here up to up to about here so i i think it i think it's i think it's water wheel and power time what i need to do is get my three ways is it facing the right way no now it is is get the three ways and put them in here properly spaced so it's um put in the three ways and then water wheels will go boom 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 well, it's happening very quickly. Look at this. The first first row of water wheels is almost done. Awesome. Sauce. Um, still a lot to do, though. And obviously, that's, that's only the first row. We've got another row to go in. Well, the water's just stopped flooding. It's uh, cycle 93, day 10. We got the full eight days of water. Oh, hell yeah. And look at the reservoir. We are up over three tiles full. Like, it's about, like, three and a quarter. And that's across both reservoirs, of course. So, water's great. How's the power? Oh, yeah. Absolutely full again. <laughs> now, the, I mean, the real test is going to be when we get, like, minimum water and then a long drought. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll have this aqueduct finished by then. And, uh, and get the guardrails on the lower, the lower aqueduct so that we're, we're not losing even a drop of water. <laughs> it's, I love the fact that there's always more you can do. There's always something else. There's always another improvement. It just keeps you going. They're, they're, starting, to, they're starting to close this gap. Once we get this gap, gap closed, then I can start thinking about the, the tower over here. And, of course, getting this bit done uh we've got one two three rows of water wheels done i can start thinking about putting the next water wheels in i'm just uh, i'm just looking at our log situation uh and letting that recover a little bit before i throw in the next set of set of water wheels okay we have got what we've got this was like a 21 day drought we've got 19 days left i wonder if i can get this finished i've decided to throw in some guardrails on the on the lower reservoir i thought we'd start like start this bombing i mean it's not that much work to do this so yeah well we'll do this we'll do this um what do i want to spin that right so we'd want it from there i'm just bringing out like this i'll have to do that bit as well but yeah i mean it, like it's only, a, it's only a couple of tiles shouldn't uh shouldn't be that much of a problem oh, i've got i've got a, a couple of uh, just one tree to remove i'm trying to take the pressure off the terraformers at the moment and put some uh, put some work to the builders so what i've done down here i've widened this by one tile so this is going to be five wide and then if we blow this and blow this right so now we're five wide from this point. So uh, once once it can it can spread out, that should alleviate the flooding uh, a bit quicker, and uh, and and this part shouldn't flood. So once we've got this wall done down to here, we've done the back wall. We've just got to complete the front wall, and and we should be fine then. Well, the drought's about to end. How did we do? 
Oh, so close. <laughs> so close, but not quite. To be honest, if you if you look at how many blocks are there, if I hadn't done this, I think I think we would have finished that. But um, it's like I mean, it, it's not finished as in functional, so it doesn't matter. That it was always going to take at least another season. How are we doing for water? I've put in a stream gauge so we can actually see we are at um, just over two tiles of water, which is great. And over here. Our batteries are well above the water level. So, yeah, we finished that season in great shape. What I do want to see is how this works out when the water gets down here. Okay, here comes the water. <laughs> this is going to be the interesting bit. And normally we would be flooding. It's creeping down. But now we've widened it here. Is it going to get all the way down, or is it going to stop? No, it's going to stop. Reducing the amount of time that the water's got to wait to get down to a point where it can expand is definitely helping this. And there you go. And, it's, and now, it's just not flooding at all. So there you go. We didn't lose a drop of water in this section. So yeah, getting this... Uh, Getting these guardrails all the way around. Yeah, that's going to be a bit of a job. But it saves us water, and that is a good thing. How are we doing? Oh, we, have we joined up? Oh, yes. Yes, we've joined up. <laughs> okay, well, the next season. Oh, and it's day four, and no warning. Wow. It just gets better and better. Okay, I mean, there's still a lot of work to do on this aqueduct to get it finished. I've, yes, I've got all three sets of water wheels in here, but we've got to sort this out. We've got to sort, uh, the, we've got to sort the tower out and, and figure out how I'm going to merge the water together. We've got all the guardrails to do. So, yeah, I mean, it's still a lot of work. And if you want to see all that work get completed, yes, you're going to have to come back for the next episode because <laughs> I've literally run out of time. <laughs> if you want to see this video today, then I need to stop and I need to get the darn thing out. Wow. The map is looking very green again. Picture. Look at this. It's all looking very green and pretty. Wow. Yeah. It's pretty. Well, enough cooing. It's time to... Uh, time to wrap up say goodbye picture bye thanks for being here guys we'll catch you for the next one peace out